118th day of Advent, a reading from the book of Isaiah. The people who walked in darkness have seen a great light. Those who lived in a land of deep darkness, on them light has shone. You have multiplied the nation. You have increased its joy. They rejoice before you as with joy at the harvest, as people exult when dividing plunder. For the yoke of their burden and the bar across their shoulders, the rod of their oppressor you have broken as on the day of Midian. For all the boots of the trampling warriors and all the garments rolled in blood shall be burned as fuel for the fire. For a child has been born for us, a son given to us. Authority rests upon his shoulders, and he is named Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. His authority shall grow continually, and there shall be endless peace with the throne of David and his kingdom. He will establish and uphold it with justice and with righteousness from this time onward and forevermore. The zeal of the Lord of hosts will do this. A prayer from Blair Meeks. Let us pray. Loving God, protector of the weak, restorer of life, you have given us streams of living water in desert places. You have turned our tears to joy and filled us with laughter. We sing glory to God in the highest for the gift of your Son. We thank you that he came to live and die among us. We praise you for your awesome power that raised him from the grave. You have done great things for us. Merciful God, you came to stay in the world you love so much. Make your presence known to those who endure pain and sorrow. Strengthen weak hands, and make firm, feeble knees. Sing words of assurance to us and rejoice over us. Give us words to say to those who are of a fearful heart. Be strong, do not fear. Here is your God. You have done great things for us. Righteous God, you made a covenant of peace with earth and its people. You love justice and hate wrongdoing. Clothe us with the garments of your goodness. Gather all the people and free us from our limitations. Guide the nations to the well of your salvation. Let our praise spring up like fountains. Call us to hear and see and sing and leap for joy. You have done great things for us. Holy is your name, O God, and your mercy is from generation to generation. You show us the strength of your arm and scatter the proud. You bring down the powerful and lift up the lowly. You fill the hungry with good things and send the rich away empty. Give us grace to be your servants, to show your glory to the nations, and give us voices to rejoice in God our Savior. In Jesus' name, amen. Please enjoy what a beautiful name composed by Ben Field. What could separate us now? 